kill assigned targets. Avoid being killed by other Templars. You have been stunned. Contract lost. You know it's going to be a good game whenever you get smoked bombed, stunned, and poisoned right as soon as you spawn into the game. I'm Lil Wooly 618 and this is Assassin's Creed Revelations. What is up guys? This is Lil Wooly 618 and with Assassin's Creed 3 coming out tomorrow, I thought I'd give you guys a little, you know, gameplay from Assassin's Creed Revelations. The last Revelations video to come out on this channel. Granted, there was only one before this, but you get the idea. Now, when it comes to Revelations, I wanted to leave the game. I wanted to end the game with a, I don't know, some, something to be proud of. You know, leave it at the top of its game. But I couldn't! Oh my god. This was probably the best game I had. And I might as well have finished in last place. Because this game was horrible. One, one bit of BS after another. It was just pandemonium for me. I, I mean, obviously with the start I, that you just saw that I had... You knew it was not going to be a great game. You could tell that I wasn't going to get a lot of kills. You could tell that I was going to get stunned a lot, killed a lot. I was going to get screwed out of so many points. But you know what? I'm glad that Assassin's Creed Revelations, for me, ended the way it did. Because you know what? That's just going to make me hope and pray that the guys over at Ubisoft made Assassin's Creed 3 the best game they possibly could. And by God, I hope they did. Because if Assassin's Creed 3 is just as bad or worse than this, then I'm never buying another Ubisoft game again. That's it. Now, I know a lot of people are going to try to put out videos as quickly as possible on Assassin's Creed 3. And trust me, you're going to try you're going to get some videos as early as I possibly can too because my plans for today. Well, I'm recording this I've been recording this yesterday Sunday. You guys will be seeing it on Monday today. But my plans for the entire day on Monday. I'm going to go to class. I'm going to suffer through any the test I have. Go suffer through three hours of just boring accounting and management courses. And then I'm going to go come back home. I'm going to put this video up on YouTube. Then I'm going to do my homework. That is due on Tuesday. Then, at around 10 o'clock p.m. Central Standard Time, I will prepare myself, along with my friend Matt. We will prepare ourselves to go to the midnight release at GameStop. Once we're there, I am going to take that game, bring my buddy and myself back home. I'm going to put the disc in. I'm going to put the Assassin's Creed 3 disc in for multiplayer. Probably deal with the release date patch. That's more than likely going to be on there. I'm going to let that patch download. As soon as it's done, I am going to get on Assassin's Creed 3 multiplayer. Put in whatever passcodes I have to. I am going to plug in my Elgato. I am going to play as much as I possibly can. Take the best game footage I can from that and make it into the video for you guys. I want you guys to get the first look at what Assassin's Creed 3 looks like from my point of view. And I promise you, it's going to be a decent breakdown. Even though I'm going to be hopped up on energy drinks 
and probably tired as hell. But I'm going to give you the best review I can possible. Because this game right here was a shitty game. Pardon my French, it was a shitty game. So hopefully Assassin's Creed 3 will be better. But guys, I will see you early tomorrow morning. And I hope you have a good day, gentlemen.